Hello everybody, welcome to the round of 16 match between Mr. Page, Clothing a Bits Chaos and Misspelled Trees, uh, Anch 5, Wood Elves. In the booth with me is Faimir and Skurametso. Hello. Hello. Everybody, Hello. welcome to this game. Tonight. Classic matchup here. You've got the Brawn of Chaos versus the Agility of the Elves. And we're going to find out if Mr. Page can resist the urge to put all of his players on a tree. And if he can roll some injuries. And there you go. Already one elf off the pitch. And, uh, you know, you don't, need, you don't need 11 elves to win a game. But you certainly need at least three. <laughs> and it's off to a bad start for, oh, well, here we go. It's off to a bad start for a misspelled tree. But then you like seeing them pile up on your uh, tree man and down he goes yep. <laughs> <laughs> so what do we got on these teams it looks like we've got a lot of movement and a lot of edge five for the elves will that uh play a factor jimmy yeah wizard and a babe they've gotten in inducements and they do have a move nine edge five dancer and a move nine, edge five catcher. They're the key players. That's really all they've got, right? Everything else is a bit meh. And Mr. Cage has lots. Pretty of... standard for a playoff Wood Elf team. Yeah, Mr. Page has lots of killingness, and he has <laughs> an edge five beastman and a strength four edge four beastman. So he's got really two really nice players, um, amongst with all of the killingness. It took a real forward position, though, with that uh, Edge 4, Strength 4 uh, Beastman, though. Seems yeah. to be kind of floating off on his own. I think he wants to score quickly. And now isolated. To, you know, avoid the wizard. Ah, uh, yes, there is the, there is the wizard. So, yeah, yeah that's, a, that's a fair point. That might be the insanity that has crossed Mr. Page's mind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, would not would not be a recommended maneuver in my books. But, uh, and as you see, that, that, <laughs> that Beastman just completely blocked out from the rest of the team right now. So it's like he's playing with even numbers. But down goes the tree. A break, a stun, a pile on. And nothing. Now he's officially a scoring threat, this guy, isn't he? He moved him forward, too, so that he's in normal range to score. Honestly, though, if you're the elves, don't you want the... Uh, the chaos having to roll those dice to try and score. I mean, I guess it's edge four and wow, even edge five for the ball carrier. So it's actually not all that <laughs> unreasonable to think that they could just pop a hole, go over, pass the ball off and score. But, you know, I don't think I mind that so much when I'm sitting on a wizard. Exactly. That gets a removal. But the uh, Palmer is exposed. Will he be fouled? Tackle Palmer. I think so. No, nope, maybe not. Is he going after the ball here? No. No, oh, he's going to free the, the, the player, I think. Oh, cheeky little armor break by the war dancer there. Now, yeah, he is going to free that. Yeah, you're right. He was freeing that dirty player up. Here comes that foul, probably. Yeah. yeah if you've got a dirty player, you've got to foul him, haven't you? <laughs> oh, absolutely. Who else? Who else to foul? I don't know why the... Oh, I see. Okay, I see what he's doing. Oh, he's given up a chance for the score, though. Yep. I yeah, think and I don't think I'd mind He's very happy with a yep. quick score for own chaos here. Yeah. Yeah, I think so, too. Oh, I'm sorry. Is misspelled tree a she? I did not know that. Yep. Yeah, it's because it's yep. miss. Misspelled tree, see? Ah, oh, fair enough. Okay. Clever. That's pretty good. So Tree Man will maybe maybe make it back to his feet. Yeah, and he here it is though. I think we're gonna I think we're just gonna score. It does look like the score here. After he blocked his path. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he should well nah, not really. no, now he has. Now it now he kinda has, yeah. Yeah, I mean, All right, he's not there isn't really much option here but to score. Nope, he is. Just going to lob it. Twos followed by twos. Easy as you like. He's got it. 
<laughs> and there you go. Early score. Begging to be 2 1 grinded there, Mr. Page. Oh, absolutely. Uh, up against, you know, a Wood Elf team with some good level ups. A, uh, a wizard. I don't know Miss Bell Tree. I don't know how aggressive she is, but. Um, no, that, could, that, the... that, that could play into it. Are we, we going to run and gun here? She's a quite decent uh, good uh, coach. I think we should see a Daka. Daka, 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 Daka. <laughs> I, I'm never comfortable with Dakas personally. I, I, I agree, though. Like, if you want, your options here are to just run it down and score and try and, try and wizard overturn and, and really put the game out of reach or just Daka and go for the go for the 2 1 grind. That's probably the safer call. See where the tree is, it's a Daka. Yeah, I think, <laughs> Daka. I think yeah. we've got our answer, folks. <laughs> there you go. Also, the tree in the middle, you know, is a good chunk of wood there. <laughs> Covers yeah. a big part of the field. 6.5 on the chunk scale. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. loses a warrior on the line, and what Apple? a what a blessing for the Daka there. No Apple. No. Catches it. Well, <laughs> probably it looks uh, all right for the Daka. Yeah, probably regretting the Daka a bit now, right? Because now with only two on the LOS, the tree hit and then Blitz one looks amazing. But um, mm -hmm. yeah, it sure does. But I guess it's okay, it's protecting your tree. Dak is still good. Will we see some farming, some pass farming? <laughs> no, just a handoff. <laughs> Looks like we're seeing at least one, or maybe just a handoff. Yeah, just a handoff. Yeah, sensible handoff, give it the best play. She's, she's not going full, Jim. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which is on the catcher, though, I'm not a big fan of that. I know there's some uh, is, uh, coach love kick, but putting it on a catcher. Yeah, I would have definitely. Too much of an investment. I would have definitely rather had sidestep. Like, after sidestep, fair enough. Because they don't get a lot after that, really, after bodge step. They don't get a lot, but obviously, with guard, makes the sidestep even better. So, yeah, I would have definitely had sidestep. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Like, if you're a Wood Elf coach with this team, you don't hate having kick in general. But, yeah, I agree. There's a way better skill that was waiting for you there. Very weak here, isn't he, this little uh, this little goat going to market? I assume that other warrior's going over there. No, he's going to blitz in. Yeah. Yeah. Blitzing that's the opposite um, side. This, this... <laughs> wow. Oh, dear. Well, we should see a huge movement to this side now. I think so. <laughs> the tree was in motion before the turn started. <laughs> it needs to start early. The tree needs to start early. You know, the right. <laughs> the right the tree was the champing, champing at the bit for that one. And yes, I said champing, not chomping. It's the correct terminology. <laughs> Is it? Yes, horses champ at the bit. They don't chomp. Mm. Although I think you can use them interchangeably. In the same way that you can use the word literally to mean figuratively, and it's actually okay. It just yes. pisses off people who are stupid. Well, let's not go too far. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, predictable. The predictable move over to this side. Yep. I think the movement of the tree was maybe a little too quick, you know, because you can wait until the last part of the turn to maybe try to do a GFI with the tree. Yeah, maybe, maybe. But then again, it's only on, like, uh, yeah. on a nudge. For, it would be either on yes. a nudge four guy or it'd be on a claw, and you don't really want to tag either of those, do you? <laughs> Scarrow can chop my bit anytime. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, fuck, I bit my tongue doing that. Yeah, I would have liked to have seen a bit more movement, and that GFI was just a waste of a reroll, really, wasn't it? Could have, could have saved a reroll. Didn't achieve anything. Um, because he has a lot of agility, Crucifer, he couldn't help himself. 
Yeah. <laughs> I think that's the answer. Yeah. He was, he was scared of the wizard and the G5 players. So he went with the classic, I just score and whatever happens, happens. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, scoring early does remove the uh, wizard and g five from the board. Mm. <laughs> so it's a no, but at spread. least at least you can say well, I, wouldn't I, have I score. On, you know, I score. <laughs> I wouldn't have piled on there. Definitely not. I guess it's still pretty hard to blitz through. Yeah, I mean, it's Mr. Page. Oh, not not really. Called, <laughs> his team is called Claw Them the Bits. If you're not going to pile on there, what are you even yeah. doing? <laughs> Well, it's not, so, called, it's not called pile on to bits. He, he clawed effectively against the edge seven or the uh, the armor seven. Yeah, you've got to do it though. Come on, man. Let's be realistic. Yeah. Here. Oh, there's a cast. Oh, the cast. cast. Who is doing in cast? Oh, Apple. That okay, that's right a wrestling right attack. There, that that's a nice piece to have. Uh, oh boy, okay. It's like, what is he doing there? Or she, excuse me. Yeah, it's a bit dodgy. At least side stuff can stay on the sideline. Yeah, incredible, incredible players. Uh, stat freaks. For Mr. Page now yep. looked really bad re using that reroll early. I, I really didn't like the uh, that GFI. Uh oh, it irrelevant GFI as well, wasn't it? I mean, this is there like... you go. Yes, yeah. the skill tree managed to cast two players in the same turn. Problem was <laughs> one of them was his own her own player, but <laughs> there you go. The, the cast equity is in the misspell tree. <laughs> yeah, I guess not entirely pointless was trying to protect that that edge five ward answer um, by going to that square, but it certainly didn't work out. No. no I guess it was but, be a yeah, G, shouldn't, but... shouldn't have been in that position. Yeah, shouldn't have been in that position G. to begin with. Yeah. yeah, okay, yeah, I guess that, that time. The other time, the other, the catcher was a pointless GFI. This was, I guess it was going to be a double GFI to screen him. Yeah. yeah. Still really should like... be able to, to, to squeak out an eight turn stall here, though. I didn't like the pylon Maybe there. Maybe it doesn't need to. It's hard though against the uh, against the arch five, right? He can always hit you. Obviously, he doesn't have tackle, but still. Yeah. And I agree, Famir. I I just wouldn't be piling on right now. <laughs> I just want my players up. Next to the ball with tackle, you can put tackle on the ball. The ball is strength too. Oh, come on. <laughs> yeah, but if you pile on, you might kill him. That's that's a very good point. <laughs> yeah, you might. That's a very good point, and getting rid of that player is uh, nearly half the game, because yeah. you know, that's fifty percent of my split three is that what the word answer. The other fifty percent is the uh, the catcher. Yeah, exactly. Like that's the thing. This is so. This player is so key. Um, I just so didn't even try to all after that hit. Interesting. Mm. I mean, that could be costly, right? Because Mr. Page. Can definitely score quickly with these two Absolutely crazy players. Absolutely can score, yeah. So yeah, I probably should have tried to get a screen. Uh, yeah, also. This this reeks of the classic wizard trap where it's a two turn. You're trying to prevent your wizard rolls a one, and uh, and then the other team scores, and then you go into the second half down two one, <laughs> looking for overtime without a wizard. Yeah. Have you seen this game already, Skuro? <laughs> oh, no, I haven't. Did I just literally spoil it? No, I haven't seen I it either. I just, thought, I just thought, okay. I wonder if that's what I happens. haven't watched the. No, I have no idea, but uh, I, I haven't watched the game. I haven't watched a game of Blood Bowl in about two weeks, maybe three. <laughs> like, um, but, like, come on, Jim, we've both watched a lot of Blood Bowl. We know exactly what happens when a team is going to fall apart. I don't even know who wins this game. I didn't look at the spoiler. <laughs> I just, I just thought you might have just known because it was like that seems like a remarkable. Oh, no, 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 it just no. seemed like a remarkably precise <laughs> <laughs> prediction. Oh, yeah, wow. right. I oh, mean, of course you got know, kicked. I Actually, watched well, the game, He's and you would, I watched the game, and you make me doubt there. It was so precise. It was like, <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, you know, ain't my first rodeo. <laughs> Boy. Oh, yeah, it's that kick actually paying off, isn't it? Uh, amazing corner yeah. kick. But Edge 5 yeah. can still do things. And so can 
Another Weedy glow. Injury. Now, the thing here is uh, all all misspelled tree is looking to do is stop this score. Not looking to counter score with that setup so deep. Yeah. You would assume. Well, maybe, right? Yeah, the, the move nine can still just best forward. Like, either of the move nines can just yeah, best but, forward in case of a misfield yeah. or a scatter. Yeah, like, no fluff pass. If it... If Mr. Page doesn't put anyone else back to help that ball, then maybe you do see the wizard praying for an armor break, but it seems seems pretty risky at this Great point. Great roll on the three, and, in this, and the third time is the charm. Tree goes down, piling on. And the tree is cast. Oh, day, day. Ooh. Brutal. Four Kaz now for the Elves. Guard on the side of him, so that's pretty protected strength four guy. Makes the GFI. Oh, sure hand saving him. GFI without... Not, uh, yeah, we're just seeing the... No reroll for the GFI there, that was horrifically scary, wasn't it? So I, I actually think... I This is probably a trap and probably the wrong decision. I actually think I would have I would have lightning bolted that uh that ball pick up there and just gone full into the second half with my elves because no one else is getting that ball. It could scatter out to a place where your elves can just retrieve it. Yeah, true, true. Three oh, oh no. Cover. Yeah, yeah. It's I mean again this is I just I just explained how this whole turn would be a trap for misspelled tree and now <laughs> I'm falling into that, the trap <laughs> that I just outlined. But I do I do feel that way. <laughs> <laughs> kind of tempting. I mean, this and is you manage to go 2-1 hard at all. Yeah. And then you receive in the second half in Woodies and you can go 3-1. That's, that's not it. Looking at twos and threes here. Uh, what? Uh, uh, this one's going to uh, score. What? This one's going to score. Okay. Just but he's three D for a push. Yeah. It's pretty easy, isn't it? Nope. Oh, there, there's the guy. Yeah, there's the guy. Okay. Yep, Interesting. <laughs> Easy the, as you like. Yeah. The there the you couch. go. Oh. <laughs> and he makes the GFI. Well, there you go. I, I think I, I think I, uh, you know, hindsight being what it is, I think I like my play better. <laughs> I think I think I like stalling out more, in the first, you know, before the score more. Y yes, absolutely, absolutely needed to stall the turn eight yeah. on that drive. I totally agree with that. Yeah, the problem, the problem was the pointless GFI from the catcher, um, the eight to reroll, yep. and then, you know, obviously should have thought more about protecting that. Dancer without having to GFI, um, in which case would have would have saved that GFI as well. So could have had two more players in the field, and an extra re-roll, and then everything would have been a lot safer. Could have easily got the extra turn of stall, and then after that, um, Mr. Page doesn't score in one turn because there was always a real good chance of Mr. Page scoring in two turns, wasn't there? With an edge five thrower and the, like, how do you stop this guy's yeah, strength four? Absolutely, edge four. And that was as good a kick as you were going to get to prevent it too, and yeah. still was nothing. And Big Lag Gaming, yeah, if ever there was a Chaos team to win a shootout against Elves, it's a team built like Mr. Pages right now. Yeah. Dif slightly different kind of shootout, I suppose, because you got to <laughs> kill as much as you got to score. <laughs> but uh, he has effectively done both for the first half of this game. Yeah. No grab tree. This is going to be... Oh, there's a blitz. Oh, brutal. Oh, oh, oh well, GG. Oh well. And look at that middle of the field, wide open on the elves. <laughs> oh, you hate to see it. Again, this could just easily become one of those, um, one of those two turns for the elves because Mr. Page just floods the ball, but it doesn't actually look like he's doing that. Right. Does the three D with mighty blow? Oh, Kaz is the the one turn oh. I got to laugh all that. Yeah. Apple fails. Apple fails. Oh. And out. Yep. That's that's GG. Oh, now you're dropping God. the early GG and praying. Oh, that's brutal, isn't it? <laughs> oh, that yeah. is brutal. Yeah, this is well over. 
I mean, it's it's not over because they've still got the dancer, but yeah, this is it's it's real bad. <laughs> the one Here turn comes attempt the one is pick off. up too. Yeah, the one turn attempt. Is <laughs> off. Certainly. Yep. <laughs> Just the push. Oh, angry reroll there. I think. I mean, there's also nothing else to reroll, is there? So. <laughs> yeah, that, there's that too. <laughs> Just gonna bail downfield here. I think we're just gonna bail downfield here. Oh, it was turn eight. Jesus. Yes, Christ. yes, cool, Roy. Was I was on turn nine. I was on turn nine. It's been a while. It's been a while. <laughs> <laughs> Pardon me. All right, so seven players. Yeah, it's tricky to stall now with seven players. We're gonna try the seven player Dakar. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that I mean, uh, that entire weird. turn was a lot worse when you think it's turn nine and not turn eight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus. And got the player on? No, and haven't got the ball on the right player, but can hand it off to the right player later. There's still a chance. Hey, we're just dacking here, aren't we? Yes. Yeah, there's no. Yeah. You can't really do anything else, can you? Especially after yeah, the way Mr. So. Page defended it in the first half, I would definitely always dacker against him. <laughs> yeah. Even with dwarves. Yeah. <laughs> Only joking, but yeah, that was... Whoa! Uh, I guess it doesn't really matter. Out of range, but... I feel like I would have protected that ball before moving that player. But you're out of range, so... I guess yeah. it doesn't really matter. Yeah, yeah, get the player back first. Yeah, never attrition fireball. Well, I guess if you're losing 3-1, then you're attrition <laughs> Yeah. But you just got to hope that he, uh, he makes some kind of fuck up here and gives you something. Will he open up that right, right flank again? I, I can't imagine with so many players' <laughs> advantage that he would leave any sort of hole here. Yeah, it's hard hard for him to uh, leave a hole now, but you've got the bolt to like make one, haven't you? So you could use the bolt to get the two yeah. two, and then uh, and then if you win the uh, toss, go for a quick two turn. Um, yeah, that guy is that guy is on his own again. <laughs> <laughs> exactly the same as the first one. <laughs> Amazing. I mean, he can't. Uh, she can't get very far up, but still. <laughs> Maybe a mistake, honestly, I to mean, try and go, because it's turn 10 with seven players. I think you just retreat another turn here. Because Mr. Page is probably going to yeah, give you that turn so. after, or you can use the wizard, like, by, by engaging <laughs> this turn. <laughs> oh. Yeah, uh, that's what she's doing. I was going to say, I don't know that Mr. Page is going to give her another turn, but then I remembered what we've been watching all game. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is just going to get the ball. Oh, another GFI. Oh. What the? I don't like these rando GFIs. Wants to get in scoring range. Wants yeah. to get in scoring range. Still. It didn't. Maybe. I don't know. I don't think that was the right play. don't think that was the right play. He's not going to have the tackle back to hit you in scoring range. And if he is you, then you worry about yeah. that later anyway. I think you've got to conserve rerolls. Like, if you score here, he, he, he just wins. Like, Mr. Page just wins now if you score here. So, you, like, there's no point being in scoring. Rerolls. Well, you still you still have the, 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 the two ward answers and a wizard. There's a there's the minor hope of the turnover and winning in regular time, but I think I think if you score this early, you're not like you're either losing in regular time or winning in regular time. There's no draw, <laughs> you know, to be had at that point. Also, I mean, two word answers and a wizard sounds like the name of a band more than the name of an actual play. <laughs> Against all these uh, mighty blow target, very complicated now. Piling yeah, on. Now this is a proper piling on. No, nothing. Yeah, the pommers coming for you every turn is really bad, isn't it? Um, yeah, that's true. The, the blitz turn here was brutal, wasn't it? Like from from a one turn attempt to getting your one turn a cast and the apple yeah. failing is just absolutely brutal. And for yeah. future chalice equity as well, in that it's been essentially, you know, it's out for the next one. And when it's back, it's he's only moving. You know, he's not moving it, so. Ooh. 
little bit hard greedy, way. Though. A little bit greedy. Yeah. Uh, I guess she's going way up, but. He wants to be in the scoring range again. Eh. Uh, eh. Uh. Yeah, maybe, maybe we should uh, use that yep. kind of Okay, first. fair enough. Can it GFI and like was it really necessary? Yeah. GFI is hell of a drag. Oh, what a question by our Jetty 86. What is equity in the context of Blood Bowl? Yeah, so like basically your chance of winning the game, basically. What well, either person's chance of winning the game is their is their match winning match yes. equity, isn't it? Or chalice equity? Is it is it is it from poker? Is it or what? Yeah. Yeah, I, uh, poker and most of the uh, games with some randomness added to it. Right. Def depends on your definition of famous, Pedro. <laughs> oh, I should have changed the uh, should have changed the title. Shouldn't I? Thank you, Pedro. But nowadays we use equity in blue. Oh, 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 the dubs. Oof, some rotten dice here. Massive equity, equity shift. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> uh, equity as a more or less a joke term uh, because people took the equity too seriously and it's hilarious, you know, how every single thing they were, oh, that athlete, the equity, is in that. <laughs> so now, you know, we have uh, GG equity, <laughs> yeah. chat equity. Equity, don't forget equity. Equity, yeah. muy, very important, yes. You go to kicks, you know, extra time equity. <sighs> Just running around like a madass equity now. Yeah, I think uh, I think you needed to do the four plus with a reroll to try and score right now. Um, oh, you're not going to get another chance at it, especially now. <laughs> yeah. Well, there's still two there's threats. One, one. No, there's two. Yeah, there's still two threats, but they can each be triple marked now. Yeah. If not more. <laughs> and one can yeah, be. Nothing's happening here. One can be tackle pommed to the shadow realm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So the other one can then be caught. Miss Spelltree has certainly made some. Miss Spelltree has certainly made some mistakes and some questionable decisions on on some stuff, but she's also had some pretty terrible dice. Yep. Multiple self removals. Every every GFI, whether necessary or enough, has been like a fifty fifty. It feels. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Absolutely horrible. But the, the biggest one being the blitz, wasn't it? Because without that blitz. Who knows what yeah. yeah. I mean, uh, against yeah. this team, so so many killing and pieces, you're going to lose players nearly every turn, so yeah. You need to take risks. He doesn't blitz either scoring threat, and there's only two markers. Yeah, and he's only double marked them. Yeah, only double marks again. I think <laughs> you got to go for it now. Oh my gosh. Instant Never mind. Fail. <laughs> And that is good. No, oh wow, Miss Spelltree has another reroll. Yeah. A single mark, yeah, because that's a garter. Yeah. Wow, still not going for the score though. Not yet. I think that was just doing it because it was safer, right, to make sure there was something. Hmm. Maybe. We'll see going for the score. What? Yeah. Oh, roll the one. Oh. Yeah, and that is going to do it, I think, for Miss Beltree. As yeah. right as rain. I like that name, though. Well played. <laughs> yeah. Is he in range? He is double GFI. For the edge 5 sure hand to pick it up. Not picking it up with the edge 5 sure hand it. <laughs> he'll probably he'll make the four it. plus pick up <laughs> <laughs> well he's got the strength for strength for blotch hasn't yeah. he go for it but uh yeah if this was a push it would have been a bit bit of a pain in the ass obviously the strip is a factor i don't know how many strippers there are instead he's probably just going to pull him off the pitch
No. There's another panel. Oh. I mean, this, this guy is obviously the better one to pick it up with because he's just there instantly instead of having a double tier 5. I was just thinking, yeah. you know, about the strip, but I guess you've got to block him first and see what happens. And then if he's still around, stripping you is, is concerning, I would say. But he's the only stripper, so. And uh, ball in hand there, pretty much, yeah. Oh, there he gets the, the wizard out. And here comes the miracle, the miracle uh, play. And it's not even hard. Ball in really? hand. Oh, it's really not that hard. Catch has got it. Gets the catch. And oh, oh where are you going? Where are you going? End zone's the other way. <laughs> Can she get out of range? No, she cannot get out of range. <laughs> ah! Another GFI, <laughs> Another GFI fail. <laughs> I feel like the. Uh, the three plus, three plus, two plus would have been, and, and touchdown would have been yeah, maybe one, more two, appealing, three, but four, it probably wouldn't five, have worked six, out. Seven, eight. Okay, so one. Yeah, maybe just two, but then if you score and you give him, if you give him two yeah. turns left, he scores, yeah. doesn't he? That's the problem against Mr. Pitt yeah. and his team. Yeah. He's, he's probably going to score a two turn if you, if you give him it. But he's gonna just win if you don't score. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing in it, Wolf. Like, yes, you can't give him three turns, but you can't give him two turns either. And how do you stall here? You've already given him two turns and failed. Now, now you've got no rerolls left. Oh, makes it. Yeah. Hey, a bit of luck. <laughs> a bit of luck for misspelled tree. Three plus, two plus to try and force Ooh. a hootie. <laughs> oh, and there you go. Making it scary right into the end. Gets the tootie. <laughs> yes, poopy scoop, yep. <laughs> An Owen <old> classic. <laughs> Right, six six players. Like you, you're not stopping this. I guess is there a kicker? Yeah, there is the kicker there. So at least. Oh yeah, the kicker is still here. on the field. I thought they were off. Maybe you risk the the kick going out of bounds to get it deeper. Probably, if there's ever a time to risk it, I guess it's this one. <laughs> Probably kick here. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, putting him further back is better, isn't it? Because they're not going to kick short. <laughs> I kick. Okay, they do kick short. I don't like the short, short kick. To get the on the other side of the field from the IE4. Yeah, I, I, I hate the short kick. I would have kicked it here. Yeah. Yeah. Bottom right was the place. Yeah. I think the only way you're winning this game as misspelled tree is on the coin toss and a sideline cage and a score or something. Yeah. You can't even sideline cage against this <laughs> against this team. Yeah, we've got, got, got sidestep, right? So you can like... Yeah, uh, yeah, that's true, yeah. That's what you've just got to do. But there wasn't much happening with that kick to win the game for you. <laughs> no, no. I did not like that kick. There is the strip, though. No, there's no strip because it's your hands even. So no, no. It's... At least like yep. getting the ball up next to your stripper has got some value, but not if, not if you're, uh, not if they've got sure oh, hands. Oh boy, boy, howdy! But he's giving you the hit on the ball. Oh baby! Oh, is this gonna be it? He's double one the <laughs> <GFI>. <laughs> Oh, there's a chance. 
Oh, how much does misspell tree? Chance. Wish you'd saved a reroll now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I guess there's not a chance. There's only one turn, but it's OT if they can get the ball away. Just punt it, I guess. Fails the leap. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> yeah, or just fail your leap into the hands now. I thought that was going right into the hands. All right, but it's next to a sidestep. Yeah. But it is, it's up who is also next to a tackle palm. And he shouldn't have even oh, yeah. <laughs> done that, if you ask me. Yeah, gets the pow. That was a real bad move, because now he could have caught it. That was. But also terrible. one of the... Yeah, oh, I see. Sorry, you're saying bad move by a page, yeah. Yeah, because even if he'd sidestepped to there, then you still get to hit him with tackle, tackle anyway. Yep. That would be a, a wonderful thing to see, but not in the cards. Oh. We're looking at a... Uh, Failed three plus three plus right. I don't think he can make it better. Three two because he's got a match for this fella. Oh three two excuse me yes yeah. Oh and he's got this one. Oh can he get? Oh he can get there with it the, yeah. He can he's get there with the edge. But Whoa. he fails it. Reroll in. Oh he's done it. He's got it and that's gonna be the ball game. No GFI oh, to it's come. A GFI. No there is a GFI to come. And he's got it. All right. Whew. Well. You know, that went about the way you probably would have expected it to with these two team builds, but uh, <laughs> I think misspelled, pa uh, mis misspelled page, misspelled tree had a chance there to make something happen. Dice were not very helpful. Mr. Page gets the win. Is this his deepest run in CCL playoffs? Very probably. I think it's probably his best team as well, uh, to be fair. Yeah. But yeah, it was ultimately it was the it was the drive, wasn't it? The offensive drive by by Miss Beltry. If she'd played that better, then she wouldn't have needed the one turn attempt, and therefore wouldn't have had the blitz <laughs> kill the catcher, <laughs> which was which was the biggest slice of bad luck. But there was loads of bad luck, wasn't there? Um, you got to say for Miss Beltry. But you know, well done, Mr. Page. He he got the win, um, and so there you go. Thank you very much, Faimio and Skurometso. Absolutely glorious commentary from you both. Thanks. It's always a pleasure. Indeed. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.